Veterans at a local retirement home will receive a pretty special honor tomorrow. For months, a woman named Millie has been heading an effort to make the veterans quilts of valor. Our Amy Frazier got a sneak peek at this labor of love just in time for Veterans Day. <laughs> well, 83-year-old Millie Beach moved into the Beaverton Retirement Home about six months ago. She decided right then she wanted to do something special to give veterans who live there a warm feeling inside and out. 83-year-old Millie Beach has been sewing since she was three. I've always sewed, and I said I'd never quilt. That was the last thing I wanted to do was quilt. Clothing was her passion, not quilting. Well, when I was young, it was doing it all by hand and putting all these little squares together. I didn't want to do that. But that all changed after a visit to Montevilla Sewing. And one of the gals that was in one of the classes was doing the quilts of Valerie Millie, I want you to get involved in this. So I did. And it's just the best thing I've ever done. The Quilts of Valor Foundation is a national nonprofit with volunteers across the country. Their mission is to cover service members and veterans touched by war with comforting and healing quilts. What does that mean to you? Everything, really. It just. <laughs> I can just feel it inside. I've got goosebumps talking about it. Since May, Millie and a team of women have been crafting quilts for veterans who live at Holiday Retirement's Edgewood Downs, where Millie is a new resident. They all have a label with their name and who quilted them and, and who pieced them. 22 veterans who live here will receive their quilt of valor in a special ceremony here on Friday. I'm proud that I served. And I'm proud that they're honoring us. It's, uh, it's quite a thing to th think about it, you know. Oh, it's amazing. I mean, you know, I've seen some of those quilts. They're beautiful. They've done so much for us, and, you know, <laughs> this is just nothing, but it's what we can do. Millie's pretty awesome, <laughs> and you know she's really devoted herself to this effort. In fact, at one point she was even working up to six hours a day really? on the quilts. Yeah, and she and she plans to continue even past you know Veterans Day, which of course is this Saturday. So big ceremony out there tomorrow, oh. though. Family and friends being invited. It should be a really special time and very well deserved. Means a at lot. That yes, yeah, so a big thank you for your service. If any of them are watching, yeah. and thanks to Millie, thanks to Millie. too right. yeah. for doing it. Yeah. Thanks for sharing, Amy.